Hello Buttercups. Today I've got you a story and it's called Mr Big and it's by Ed Veer. And this is my cat Lottie and she's going to listen to the story as well because she likes stories and cuddles lots. Okay, Mr Big. Let me tell you a story about a friend of mine who goes by the name Mr Big. Now, Mr Big had a small problem. Compared to everyone else, he was extremely big. Look, he's so big, he's filling up nearly the whole page. He was so big that anywhere he went, everyone saw someone big and scary. No one stuck around to find out who he really was. So inside, Mr. Big felt very, very small. He was looking really sad, sitting all by himself. And that's how it always was. When Mr. Big went to the cafe, everyone else had other things to do. He's having to have his cup of tea all by himself. When Mr. Big got on the bus, Everyone else got off. And when he went to the pool, well, let's just say everyone needed to be somewhere else. And they're all getting off, running away, looking quite scared. And he's in the pool all by himself. I think I'd be quite sad and a bit lonely too. One day, Mr. Big noticed a piano in a shop window. It looked all alone, just like him. So he bought it and took it home, carrying it up the stairs. It must have been quite heavy. As Mr. Big sat alone at the piano, he thought of all the things that made him sad. And then he played. Can you see the music? going out of the window so everyone else can hear it. His music drifted out through the open window and into the evening sky. It drifted across the rooftops over to his neighbours and they wondered who was playing such beautiful music. The word spread and night after night everyone came from all over town and still, no one knew who was playing. It was a big mystery. Look, everybody's in the streets dancing and having a brilliant time. But inside, Mr. Big was still alone. And he's even crying. Poor Mr. Big. And then, one morning, Mr. Big received his first ever letter. It says on here, the pianist. That's what we call someone that plays a piano. It was an invitation and it said, Dear Mystery Pianist, thank you for your beautiful music. Everyone's been listening to you for weeks and we're all wondering one thing, who are you? We'd love to meet you. Me and a couple of the guys are playing tonight at the Blue Note. Please come and join our band. See you later. Signed, a friend. That night, Mr. Big joined the band. All night long, the joint was jumping and nobody wanted to leave. At last, everyone could see the real Mr. Big. Let's hear it for Mr. Big, this one says. Now that the big band has hit the big time and everyone wants to meet him, Mr. Big has a new problem. He doesn't get much time to be alone. And that's just the way he likes it. This one's saying, wow, can I have your autograph, please? And here he is, driving in the car with his friends, not lonely at all anymore and really happy. I hope you've enjoyed the story, Buttercups. See you soon with another one. Bye.